Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. The Honorable, all of the juries, the Honorable, the headmaster of my school, Lady State Junior High School 1 Aitma, all teachers and my beloved friends. First of all, I like to thanks to Allah Subhanahu wa taala, the one and only God, the strong, the forgiving, the giver. So I can be here to join the English speech contest. Second, salawat and salam to our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, who have brought us from the darkness to this bright mirror era that we live in today. Third, I would like to say thank you to everybody who have a given personal time to attend this course. Ladies and gentlemen, for those of you who are still in school or have experience of it, I want to ask you something. Have you ever had friends who has a habit of harassing another friend by mocking or even misbehaving to get attention or just for fun? Or maybe it was you. You have to know, it's a form of bullying where bullying has devastating effect on the victim affected by bullying. But to my surprise, bullying has now become a custom on the school environments and is commonplace. So now, on this occasion, I like to convey my discourse and a title: "Stop Bullying." Ladies and gentlemen, bullying is any form or violence that is intentionally carried out by one person or group of people who are stronger or more powerful towards another person with the aim hurting and is carried out continuously. Bullying is a case that can happen anywhere in homes, schools, and communities. In today's life, bullying is often found in school circles. Bullying may seem like a small problem for some people. Most people may not realize that the damage caused by bullying can be so serious. It can be as serious as death in extreme cases. If you think that bullying is not a serious matter to deal with just because it merely hurt feelings, then I have to tell you that you are completely wrong. This morally hurt your feelings thing can be the beginning of various worst scenario such as physical assault, suicide, or any other kind of violent act carried out in the name of revenge. Ladies and gentlemen, there are three factors caused bullying. First, family factor. Second, school factor. Third, as the last, peer factor. Ladies and gentlemen, bullying can take the form of physical, verbal, and psychological. Bullying behavior has a very bad impact on the victim, including it can make the victim experience mental disorders, decreased interest in hobbies or activities they enjoy, health problems, decreased academic performance, and etc. So, if you are students and you are currently being bullied by some of your friends, I will tell you how to handle it. Step 1. Ignore them. If they keep doing their action or even do something worse, such as blackmailing you or and make, asking you to do something that you don't like, or forcing you to give them some money, try to be brief and report it to your teacher. Because it is no longer just bullying, it's a crime and they deserve harsh punishment. But if you are the bully, I just can say, please stop for your own good. Why? Let me explain for you. As we know, the times has grown exponentially. Even now, we can use a lot of social media to expose whatever we want. Then, what if the persons you are bullying makes a post 
about to about to kill himself and it's because you are the one who would him and sir you'll be famous in no time i hope you can enjoy these unforgettable times it's just a small part of it we don't know what else extreme stuff to do for revenge so we know now we must know that bullying have a very very bad impact on both the victim and the perpetrator so please stop bullying let's work together with all levels of society especially teachers and parents to jointly create a conducive environment and give extra attention to related students so that the nation's generations is not only smart but also have a good character that's all my speech thank you for your nice attention i'm so sorry if there is any word or my behavior which unpleasing you all and to the god i beg for forgiveness i'm now anur alifa wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh